What is industrial and systems engineering? If you're struggling to find or understand the answer to this question, don't worry. Even industrial engineers themselves can struggle to answer the question. In this video, I am going to attempt to define industrial engineering, hopefully in a way that is more simple and understandable. However, to do this, I am going to be using an official definition and then breaking it down in a more simple way. There are many definitions of industrial engineering out there, but I am going to be using the definition from the Institute of Industrial and Systems Engineers, which is the largest society dedicated to the profession of industrial and systems engineering. Going forward, it is important to note that the term industrial engineering can often be interchangeable with the term industrial and systems engineering because modern industrial engineering has evolved to have a more systems orientation and the term industrial and systems engineering reflects that and is more inclusive. However, it's also important to note that the term systems engineering is a different discipline and has its own institution and definitions that are different to industrial engineering alone or even industrial and systems engineering alone. So the Institute of Industrial and Systems Engineers uses the following definition for industrial and systems engineering. Industrial and systems engineering is concerned with the design, improvement, and installation of integrated systems of people, materials, information, equipment, and energy. It draws upon specialized knowledge and skill in the mathematical, physical, and social sciences, together with the principles and methods of engineering analysis and design to specify, predict, and evaluate the results to be obtained from such systems. Okay, so that definition is quite loaded and I wanted to break it down into its different components and hopefully simplify it a little bit so that it can be better understood. So in more simple and more casual terms, the industrial engineer figures out how to do or make things better. To link this simpler definition back with the official definition, we can start by explaining what is meant by things. So industrial engineers make things better, and so these things can be different types of resources. So certain aspects of people, material, information, equipment, energy, and or integrated systems of several resources. When defining these things that industrial engineers deal with, it's also really important to note that industrial engineers, unlike more traditional engineers, typically don't deal with the physical thing itself. Rather, they tend to be studying some sort of abstract or conceptual um, aspect of that thing. So that would be something like the time it takes to produce something, or the uh, way to transport a material from one place to another. So they won't necessarily be designing a machine, for example, but they would study the time that that machine is taking to manufacture something. Or they won't necessarily be designing a product, but they would, for example, study um, how long it takes to get that product from point A to point B. Or they might be studying the cost behind an entire process. Now we can move on to the better part of the definition industrial engineers figure out how to do or make things better. Now, this can really vary depending on the different context or industry that you're dealing with, but essentially industrial engineers will have a certain goal that they're trying to reach. And this better could refer to any form of improvement, such as reducing the waste of resources, increasing production efficiency, or enhancing the product quality. So really better is just about what you're trying to do with that resource or that concept that you're working with. Now to close off this explanation about industrial and systems engineers, I wanted to talk a little bit about how industrial and systems engineers make or do things better. Now, according to the definition, they use different specialized knowledge and skills from the mathematical, physical, and social sciences in combination with different engineering methods of design and analysis. So really what industrial and systems engineers do is they look at a certain system or process, they 
define a certain metric that they are interested in improving, whether that's time or cost or worker satisfaction, and then they essentially do an experiment um, or design a certain method of improvement and they try that out and they measure the results and they see if that actually improved the process or not. Now, of course, it is impossible to fully define industrial engineering in just a few sentences, but I do hope that this video helped to explain broadly what industrial engineering is and what industrial engineers can do. Thank you so much for watching and please consider subscribing if you enjoyed.